Hey there, if you're looking for a fun and easy way to earn rewards, including cash and prizes, check out the link in the video description. Amanda Knox has arrived at a court in Florence to hear the outcome of her attempt to overturn a slander conviction she received for wrongly accusing a bar owner of murdering the British student Meredith Kircher. Knox, 36, said on X this week that she hoped to clear my name once and for all of the false charges against me. The American arrived at the appeals court with her husband, Christopher Robinson, but did not respond to questions from journalists. The hearing is taking place behind closed doors and the verdict is expected later on Wednesday. Knox, who, along with her Italian ex-boyfriend Rafael Salicito, spent four years in prison after being convicted over Kircher's murder in 2007, asked for the slander conviction to be dropped on the basis of a ruling by the European Court of Human Rights in 2019 that found her defense rights had been violated during police questioning in 2007. Italy's top court ordered a retrial of the slander conviction in October. The challenge to the conviction was also enabled by a 2022 reform to Italy's Code of Criminal Procedure. Kircher, a 21-year-old student from Colston, South London, was murdered in the home she shared with Knox, an American, in the university town of Perugia in November 2007. Her body was found in her bedroom, partly undressed with multiple stab wounds. She had been sexually assaulted. Knox was handed a three-year jail term after wrongly accusing Patrick Lumumba, who owned a bar where she worked part-time in Perugia, of having committed the crime. Lumumba spent two weeks in jail and was released only after a witness came forward with an alibi for him. Knox's sentence was served during the four years she was imprisoned before being found not guilty of Kircher's murder on appeal in 2011. Lawyers for Knox, who at the time was a 20-year-old student who spoke basic Italian, argue she made the allegation against Lumumba under police duress and did not have legal assistance or an interpreter. Lumumba is a civil plaintiff in the Florence trial and his lawyer. Carlo Pacelli, asked for the slander conviction to be reinstated. Pacelli said in October that Lumumba had never received a cent of the compensation money that Knox was ordered to pay over the allegation, which led him to lose his business and move his family out of Italy. Knox and Salicito were definitively acquitted of Kircher's murder in a high court ruling in 2015 that described stunning flaws in the investigation that led to their convictions. Rudy Geed, who was the only person definitively convicted of the murder, was released from prison in November 2021 after completing 13 years of a 16-year sentence. Geed is under investigation for allegedly physically and sexually abusing an ex-girlfriend since being released.